It's fantastic to get the, the first one under the belt. And it was something we said at the start of the week was no matter what the performance, it has to be a, a win. So, you know, we had to do what we, what we needed to do towards the last 10, 15 minutes. It was a little bit, it was a little bit scrappy, but sometimes you just got to fight it out. Well, first of all, I think that just sticking with our game plan and not hyper-focusing on being the first team or one of the first teams to give up their goal, um, I think that on defense we were just completely solid. My back line made my job so easy tonight. I mean, I think Eric Skrowski probably had like 27 saves. It seemed like every shot went right to her, so they made my job really easy tonight. It was just managing the game, and I think that we tried to make them as predictable as possible, but they're a good team, and um, that stat does not show what they can do offensively. So I'm really proud of the efforts that we had tonight um, on defense and offense also. I think all week we just worked on the details um, defensively as a unit, as a back line, and as a team um, as a whole. And I think we stayed together tight. We uh, talked a lot, communicated a lot today. And uh, I think we just stayed as a unit very, very tight. And um, I think that helped us today without with the clean sheet. I think we just worked really well together as a team to keep the clean sheet, keep them in front of us, not give them any really good opportunities, and then be dangerous in transition and get attacks and get balls into the box and be dangerous uh, in front of the goal. Uh, there's a lot of positives to take. You know, you can you can weigh the two games up. Obviously, different opponents, but last week we came out at halftime one zero up. Same this week. So you know, we talked about that halftime just about how we manage the game, how we make sure that we don't find ourselves in the same situation again. And you know, all credit to the, the, every single player. They showed a real level of maturity and a real level of professionalism right till the 93rd minute. So they deserve you know a huge amount of credit. Well, I think that the way we set up our defense for those kicks is especially designed for that. Um, that's a defender's job in those moments. And so I really commend Aaron and Taylor and whoever's been back there to clear those uh, for doing their job. And I just I feel secure knowing that they're on my right and on my left and that they're going to take care of the job. Um, and yeah, it's ultimate trust. So I think that off the field relationships help with that. We're a really close team. And that's something that I've noticed with this team this year being new is everyone really gets along well. And I think that we have the chemistry. And I think if we really focus focus on that, well this will just be a starting point for us and we can only go up. It feels awesome just to still be able to play on your sack field, four years at Rutgers and now still playing here and just to get those three points in front of our fans and um, it just feels awesome and feels good. You know, it's something that I was really keen to do from the, the start is to build the relationships and give everybody an opportunity to establish themselves within the team and play without, you know, the pressure of, you know, worrying about what mistake might be the end of their playing time in the, you know, in the starting lineup. So it's good to see that connection. I think we can do even better, to be quite honest with you. We can reduce the amount of attempts on goal that we face. But again, the back four and, and Carlin deserve a huge amount of credit. They came under serious pressure the last 10, 15 minutes against very good players. And, you know, they, they did what we had to do to, to get that clean sheet. I'm glad to be a part of such a great organization and do my best to try and make this team better. Yeah, I would say that the last year of my career has been a huge growth spurt, uh, especially technically. Um, growing through just college, I had three coaching staffs and uh, multiple goalkeeper coaches and sometimes no goalkeeper coach. And so from the point I stepped foot onto the field at Seattle to now with Jill, I think that technically and tactically, um, there's just been a lot of improvement and I have to thank Jill for that for sure. Um, getting me into those positions, breaking down film, we do all of those things to make sure that I can really maximize um, my body, my athleticism and just put myself in the best positions possible. But like I said, I didn't really have to do much tonight uh, because the defenders put themselves in good positions, so that's good. <laughs> you and Christy Rampone have both been playing really well at the center back position. She's the ultimate veteran, you're a rookie. What's that relationship like and that partnership between the two center backs? Yeah, I mean, it's growing every single day, every single minute, pre pretty much at practice. And just for me to have the opportunity to play with her, I couldn't ask for more. And I, like I said, I'm learning every day, and I think we're continuing to become a unit together. And I think that builds throughout the back line and throughout the whole entire team. And I think it's continuing, going to continue to benefit us throughout the whole season. The big thing I said to the players before the game was this is not the, the Boston team that's sitting at the bottom of the table. It's not a fair representation. They're, they're a very, very good team. They're, they're very disciplined on their mat. They work hard to create serious amounts of chances in every game they've played. You know, and they, they haven't had that rubble of the green, and it's going to come, and they will get better. So from our perspective, we had to make sure that, mo first and foremost, we were not complacent. We were organized, we were disciplined, and when we were on possession of the ball, we, we took our chances because they're not going to give you many chances. 